Hi, I'm James Cooper. Today I just want to share why do we need Agile Learning Classroom for the purpose of PAK 21 to replace our current classroom setting which is very traditional. In the Agile Classroom uh, Learning, if you see that it provides students to learn in motion and not in rigidity. Uh, if you look at our current uh, settings of the classes that they are in a fixed uh, table, fixed chair, and that's why they're going to sit for the whole week, regardless of whatever subject or whatever way that is being taught to them. But having an agile classroom where all the tables and chairs or even the mobile traffic is being in a very uh, a mobile situation, uh, students are given a greater amount of flexibility and also freedom where we don't control their behavior but we provide them with a platform where they can set themselves where they want to be in order for them to receive the knowledge that's being imparted by the teacher. And therefore we provide an environment, a new learning environment using the same setting. For example, uh, if the student is having a group discussion, so they will position themselves at the table and chair and they will be having their own discussion while the teacher is walking around. And maybe in another situation where the teacher gives them a test, so the tables are all being isolated and students are able to uh, do the test that is being given by the teacher. And maybe for another situation where there's a good presentation, so students will, again, they will assemble themselves in their, using the tables and chairs where they're able to present to the classroom. So this mobile factor gives um, the authority for the students to run their class. So greater freedoms brings them a greater joy in learning in the class and it becomes a student-centered learning where teacher facilitates the class. And um, subsequently, the classroom is actually becoming the second teacher in the class itself. An agile classroom doesn't just benefit the students, it also benefits the teachers. It frees them from their desk. Uh, many classrooms are arranged with teachers being the focus up front. Therefore, it limits their creativity and for them to express themselves in the class. If teachers can move, the, uh, move freely in the class, and it creates more opportunities and different types of teaching and learning takes place in the class. And because of the condition of the class itself is mobile, so teachers can move around in the class and it changes the behavioral activity not only for the students but also for the teacher. So we see a two-way communication between the teacher as well as the student and they achieve a better outcome in the teaching uh, and learning in the classroom.